Oh, I love that. Uh, look at you guys all moving to that. Justin Bieber, Jack, you there. That is brand new music. Where are you now? 102.7 Kiss FM. That's hot, man. Thank you. It's so good. It is. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> it's so good. You got to be really proud of that. Yeah, I'm really proud of it. Um, what was it? What did the crowd do? So you did this at Ultra, which yeah, is they like were a, all jumping up and down. I was really surprised. Like I was saying a second ago, I'm, I was really surprised because it wasn't like my crowd. And, now it uh, is. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I, I was just really happy to be able to perform with Skrillex and Diplo, uh, in such a cool atmosphere. That's so. Cool. I mean, look at your evolution, though. Talk, talking about where you started, what you were doing yeah. at the beginning, and then that kind of music yeah. right there with those guys. It's fa fantastic. Thank you. It's fantastic. Justin Bieber's going to be doing that at our Wango Tango. Wango Tango is uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be the hottest show. Okay, but now that I've tasted that song, you, is that the is that the vibe that we'll be hearing on, on the an album? album? I think that there'll be snippets of that type of stuff, but I think the album is gonna be really musical, a lot of real instrumentation. Do you is there a a song that is a response to the heart wants what it wants? Did you ever think about that? No. no Will no, there be? No, no. Because you're not um, done yet. I think yet. a lot of my inspiration comes from her. Comes from that. Yeah. Because I mean, that was a, obviously an emotional. It was a long relationship. Yeah, a real and relationship that created heartbreak and created um, happiness and a lot of different emotions that I wanted to write about. So and that's lot, on this album. Yeah, there's a lot of that on this album. But not a direct response. Not a direct response, no. Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm just checking. Yeah. I'm just checking on you, man. Just little pieces of you what, in response. What, what about this? Uh, and I don't want to embarrass you. But I know you can handle this. Mm -hmm. But there's this new girl that new I met. Girl. Yeah, that I met. What are you talking about? Come on, man. <laughs> what are you talking there's about? Your a new, face is there's turning a, there's bright a, red. There, all right, so there's a new girl uh, that I met okay. that is just in, I don't want to say you're in love with her, but right. it is, she's definitely by your side, and she's here. And she's about this big. Yeah. Uh, what's her name? Oh, Ryan. Esther. Esther. Yeah, so Esther puppy. is Justin's new puppy. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, no, nothing. Oh, don't be so let down, All Ellen. right, okay, so Esther. I love Esther, too. <laughs> Esther's just new. Here's She's Esther so right cute. here. This is. Aw, she wants When did you daddy. get Esther? I got her Aww. about a week, two, almost two weeks ago now. Does she sleep with you? She does. She's so Who cute. else sleeps? No, she's so cute. I took a picture with <laughs> Esther. Oh, my God. Uh, she's a silky terrier. What did, oh, really? Yep, she's uh, like eight weeks old. Does she have <laughs> brothers and sisters? Maybe you should get two. Maybe. Like, just to be clear, like, Justin Bieber needed... That kind of Aww. cuteness to help him out in the world of singleness, <laughs> right? This, she's definitely a chick magnet. Yeah, Did well, you get a baby because Scooter had her. a baby and you wanted a baby too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's so cute. Is she potty trained? Uh, no, not yet. I'm not yet. Oh, she's so cute. She actually has been doing pretty well on those pads. Yeah, the PP pads. Yeah, the wee wee pads, pads work. Yeah. I was going to ask about the marks on your neck. Okay. TMZ said they were love bites, and then no, when you no, said no. a girl, love bites. No, and then no, no, you no, no, said, no. "Oh, okay," and Ryan said she's Marks in love with you. Marks on my neck. I I, uh, I have scar tissue on my neck, so I they use this thing called uh, what is it called? Grastin. It's like yeah. this little this metal thing that they scrape on your neck just oh. to get rid of the scar tissue. Oh, so it leaves some sort of marks. Oh, because they were like that saying hurts. that someone was sucking it on you. Sometimes. No. And that's a, a tattoo on the other side, right? On what side? On your neck. This side, yeah. 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 Patience. Patience. Yeah. I Patience. got a lot of tattoos since the last time I saw you. Dude, I've seen you. <laughs> like, I've seen these pictures of these tattoos. Yeah. What's up with that? You keep going. Arms. That you, but first of all, you, just young and stupid. Right? No, no, no. I mean, yeah. no, no. I like all the work you, that I've gotten. I got it all across the world you, when I was on tour and stuff. It's all memories and all stuff that I, I'm not going to regret. But do you, like, are these things, as you say, do you ever go in and go, oh, shoot, I shouldn't have done that one? No. I think about it for like a couple weeks before mm -hmm. I get it. It's a Ryan pain. still I, has nothing. I, I've never done one. I want to get my arms to be bigger, yeah. and then maybe I would put something <laughs> on the inside of my arm. But I think you have to have you have to have some size before you get a tattoo oh, as a dude, or it looks of weird. Size. I got them before I got some size. I put on a little bit of size. Do you you jacked are you, up, bro? Are you working out with Floyd? Uh, we we do some training together, but that's not where I, I work out and do free wakes and stuff. Uh huh. He but does you, a lot of cardio and. You got pretty jacked. Didn't you? I did, yeah, I haven't been working out in the past like month or so. Good, oh, that really? makes me happier. But it didn't. Yeah. You didn't lose anything, I lost, right? I lost a, a little, little bit, bit of muscle. A little bit of mass. Because but... muscle is good memory. <laughs> 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 and yeah. Speaking of uh, the fight, so are you yeah. going to the fight? I am going to the fight. I'm actually walking Floyd out. So. You're oh, you are. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. What's the, what face are you gonna make when you walk him out? I gotta give a stone cold face. <laughs> <laughs> are, is he gonna play your song? What's the music? Um, you guys will have to just see. It's gonna be a surprise. Did but you write him something special? It's a surprise. And mm -hmm. and why why are you walking him out? 
um, we're really close, and uh, I'm there to support him. Dude, is this it is true? The, this is his biggest fight of his career. That um, when he's not in training, he goes to the bank every day, or his assistant does, takes out a hundred grand, and he gives it out throughout the night, every single night when he's not training. I don't know about every single night, but lots but of he's nights. Very, he is very generous with yeah. his money. That's when is this? When is this Floyd fight? Uh, um, this Floyd fight is May second. Yeah, Saturday. May second. Yeah. Justin Bieber walking him out with the face with, that you with gotta the surprise see. Stone cold face. The stone cold tough face. Yeah. You gotta see that. Yeah. Uh, all right, so before you go, everyone has been waiting for me to ask, are you single or dating, or what's the story? I'm single right now, yeah. And and do you enjoy that? I do enjoy it, yeah. I would imagine. Yeah. All right, Justin Bieber, <laughs> going to be at our Wango Tango. Brother, so proud of, of the evolution here. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm glad that you did what you did. You, you, you. you take responsibility. You're growing up. You're working on some hot new music, and I always wish you the best. I got one more favor. Yeah. Can you play Where Are You Now one, t- one more time? Yeah, we do right now. All right. Hold on, where is that? Pull Why that back. Pull that back up. Only one more time. Uh, right, we'll put it right on the back. You got on stage, and you apologized. Mm. What was the message? I gave her a little roast too, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, 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 but I think that a lot of people were interested to hear what you had to say. Yeah. And what was the message that you wanted to send? What did you want people to understand from the apology? I wanted wanted them to understand that, um, like I'm I'm a real human being. People, I think people forget that, and I'm growing up. I'm figuring some stuff out. 